Coronavirus, COVID-19, SARS-CoV-2, pandemic. We hear these words all day long and lives of most people around the world have been touched by this unfortunate event. Undoubtedly, these are difficult times, but let's take out a few minutes to look at some little changes the coronavirus situation has brought in our lives, which are helping us now and will in the times to come. First on the list, without a doubt, is a habit of washing hands. We can all agree that regular hand washing is now going to be our second nature. This will even reduce the risk of catching seasonal flus and will increase the general well-being in people. Next is learning new skills at home. Staying home is giving some people more time to pursue their hobbies and some are learning new skills to make the best use of time. Cooking, knitting, gardening, exercising at home or even learning a new language. Online resources like YouTube have something for everyone. Every morning I look forward to my PE class for Joe. It sure is good fun. Next is more family time. Staying home has definitely given most people a chance to appreciate family time. With mum and dad home seven days a week, I personally feel that I get to spend a lot more time with them and we do a lot of new activities as a family. Trust me, you'll cherish these moments in the times to come. Next is learning to cook. Closure of most of the eating joints might have forced people to cook, but this could actually mean many new cooks are making, or some are igniting their love for cooking. But you are learning a lifetime skill here, to enjoy healthy meals. Guys, I've learned to make banana bread this week. Mmm, yum. I hope you've tried a new recipe too. Next is online schooling. With the announcement of school closures, I thought I might not see my friends for weeks or maybe even months. But online classes have cheered everyone up in my school. I can see all my friends and my teacher every day and not miss out on the learning. This idea might open new avenues for teaching in the future. Maybe our teacher cannot attend school on some day, but she can record a lesson for us in advance or maybe have an online class from home. Next is more work from home. In the time of this lockdown, many new workplaces would have learnt or created ways to manage some or all of their work from home. In future, that will give more opportunities to people to work from home when they need. This would definitely reduce pollution linked with travel to work and no doubt improve work-life balance for people. Next is more online shopping. Isolation and lockdown mean necessary shopping only, and that too with the preference to online shopping, so you can support social distancing. While supermarkets are extending their capacity to support the surge in online shopping orders, even people might find it more convenient and, in the times to come, continue to even shop their weekly grocery online from the comfort of their home. Next is more robust healthcare system. Healthcare systems around the world are making the best possible advances to handle the pandemic. While the vaccine might be ready in record time, even the hospitals will be more robust and prepared to handle future emergencies, should there be one. Next is more internet savvy. Whether it's kids learning to join online school meetings or grandparents learning to connect to Skype or people experimenting with online shopping, these technology effects are going to teach more people a lot of positive ways of using the internet in everyday life. Last but not least is appreciate the normal. We don't realise how much things mean to us until they're gone. Same is the case with freedom. A few weeks ago, most people felt life was boring and monotonous, even when they could go anywhere they wanted, any time they wanted. These tough times will make us realise the importance of seeing our friends when we wanted, going to the nearby playground on a sunny day, 
and all the little things we took for granted. I'm sure when life gets back to normal, we'll definitely learn to appreciate the normal. Please follow your government guidelines to stop the spread of this virus. Stay home, save lives, and don't forget to wash your hands. Please subscribe to my channel for more interesting videos. See you in my next one. Till then, stay safe and take good care of yourself.